good morning, good afternoon. For all welcome to Better Faith Kid Learning Platform. My name is Mr. Benjamin Rubin. I'm here this morning to teach basic science for basic five and primary five. And the topic is drawing instruments. The topic is drawing instruments. Drawing is representing pictures or diagrams made with a pencil. Drawing is the art of representing pictures. These pictures or diagrams made with a pencil. Or drawing is a form is a form that preceded is a form that preceded writing and that continues to serve as form of communication. But drawing becomes more technical when we use different type of pencil and different type of drawing instruments. It becomes more technical when we use different type of pencil and different type of drawing instruments. What is drawing instruments? Drawing instruments are those instruments we use for drawing. An instrument for drawing. Drawing instruments are instruments used for drawing. What are the examples of drawing instruments? Some of the examples of drawing instruments include we'll have a drawing board, T square, set square, ruler, protractor, French curve, and drawing sets. These are some of the examples of drawing instruments. Drawing is a form of communication because drawing is a form of communication because there are so many objects that we we'll see in drawing, though we might have not seen that object in real life. But through drawing, we are able to it will be able to give us a reflection of how that particular object will look like. That is one of the important of drawing. It's a form of communication. Some of you might have not seen some of the objects, but maybe while going, going through your textbook, you will see the drawing of that particular object, how that object looks like. When you see that particular object in real life, with the art of drawing, it will give you a reflection of how that particular object will look like. And drawing becomes more technical when we use different types of pencil and different drawing instruments. So these are some of the examples of drawing instruments. This is our drawing board. Example, example, a good example picture of a drawing board. This is a T square. This is a T square. We also have ruler. This is a good example of ruler. This is a plastic ruler, and this is a good example of a wooden ruler. Then we also have the protractor, the 45 set square. The 30, 60 degree set square and the French curve. So, what? Let me explain the meaning of a drawing board. Or what do you understand by the term drawing board? Drawing board is a flat wooden board with a smooth, rigid surface on which drawing paper is placed. It is on top of this drawing board that we place our drawing paper if we want to carry our drawing. Drawing paper, uh, drawing paper is usually placed on top of a drawing board. Then a T square. If you look like, if you look at this shape, this shape looks like T, letter T. A T square is an instrument that has a head and a stop. It is used for drawing horizontal lines and vertical lines. T square can be used draw an horizontal lines and vertical lines. We also have the set square. A set square is a transparent plastic instrument. This is a good example of a set square. This is a good example of 45 degree set square and this is a 30 degree set square. It is a plastic, it is a transparent plastic instrument which is in two sides, that is the 30 degree set square and the 45 degree set square. And it is used to draw horizontal lines and vertical lines. 
Set square is used to draw an horizontal lines and vertical lines. Then ruler, we have ruler. Ruler, we use ruler to measure lines and we also use ruler to draw lines. Ruler could be made of, could be made of wood, metal or plastic. There are some rulers, they are, they are made of wood, while some are plastic. Like this, the one I'm holding right now is plastic ruler. We also have wooden ruler. This is a good example of wooden ruler and we also have metal ruler. French protractor. This is a good example of a protractor. A protractor is a transparent plastic material used to measure angles. The essence of this protractor, we use protractor to measure angles and it is graduated in degree, ranging from 0 degree to 180 degree. So we use protractor to measure angles. Remember that angles are measured in degree. French curve. We use French curve. French curve will have different types. We use French curve. This is a good example of a French curve to draw different shapes and curves. The extent of French curve using French curve while drawing is to draw different shapes and different curves. Then drawing set. A drawing set is a pack containing different items like compass, dividers, etc. Another good example of drawing instrument is the taste and thumb tax. Taste and thumb tax. Taste and thumb tax, they are used to fisting drawing paper to a drawing board. We usually use taste and thumb tax to hold our paper on top while drawing. If we place our paper on top of a drawing board, then we will not use tape and thumb tacks to hold it. A good example, we also use maxing tape to hold our paper so that our paper will not, our paper will be stable on top of the drawing board. We also have drawing materials. Drawing materials, on the other hand, are items that get consumed with use. Drawing materials, as we, as we make use of them, continue in the art of drawing, Drawing materials, we will make use of drawing materials, it gets, it, a time will come, it will be consumed. So they include the following, we will have drawing paper. Drawing paper is a good example of drawing materials. And this paper is commonly used for technical drawing, which is A4. Though we we'll have different type of drawing paper, we we'll have the A1, we we'll have A2, we have A3 and A4, depending on the work to be done. We have pencil. Pencil, we have different type of pencil. We have the two-head pencil. Two-head pencil is used for constructing lines. Two-head pencil, we have different type of pencil. We have the two-head pencil, we have the 2 b pencil, we have the eight b pencil. Then what is the excess of a, why do we usually use 2 b eight pencil in drawing? 2 eight pencil is used for construction lines, while eight pencil is used for lettering, for lettering and, for lettering and ticking of visible lines. The heavy pencil can also be used while carrying out a free hand drawing, a free hand sketching. A free hand sketching. Pencil sharpener. We normally use sharpener to sharpen blunts or broken pencil teeth. Sharpener is also used to sharpen up pencil to conical shape. Then we have eraser. This material is used to remove mistakes. It is made of soft quality rubber. It can also be used to clean pencil mark on a paper. While drawing, maybe in the process of drawing and you happen to make a little mistake on your drawing, you can use eraser to erase some of the mistakes. Then we have, how can you care for most of these drawing instruments? You know, it is good for us to keep our materials, our drawing instruments, so that it will not uh, get spoiled. So, most of the ways we can keep or care for our drawing instrument include one, do not use sharp objects. Never use 
any sharp objects on the edges of your set squares. And all your drawing papers should be kept in a flat file or jacket. So it will be good for us to keep our drawing instruments in good condition so that we can continue to make use of them when necessary. Practice exercise. What is drawing? You are expected to answer this question on your own. Remember that practice makes us to be perfect. What is drawing? What is drawing instruments? List five drawing instruments. You are expected to answer these questions on your own. And you are also expected to go through the notes. You are expected to go through the notes very well for more understanding. You are expected to go through the notes over and over. Don't just sit back at home and say maybe this period is a period of lockdown. You are, remember you are preparing for your primary six exam. Your primary six exam is at the corner. So remember to go through your note. Don't just sit down at home. Thank you.